Ever wonder why dogs smell each other's butts? Let's explore it a little more. Dogs have a unique and intricate way of communicating, and one of the behaviors that might seem puzzling to humans is their tendency to smell each other's behinds. Here are 10 reasons why dogs engage in this behavior. 10. Scent Identification Dogs have scent glands in their anal region that release a distinct odor. Smelling another dog's rear end helps them identify the individual dog by its unique scent, kind of like a furry version of exchanging business cards at a networking event. 9. Personal Identification Dogs can gather information about each other's age, gender, diet, health status, and even mood from the chemical compounds present in their anal secretions. It's like their very own canine LinkedIn profile, with all the quirky details. 8. Social bonding. Sniffing each other's rear ends is a form of social bonding among dogs. It's a way for them to establish familiarity and trust within their pack or social group. Kind of like having a heartfelt conversation over a cup of coffee, except with a bit more tail wagging and less actual conversation. 7. Information exchange. Dogs can learn about where the other dog has been, what it has eaten, and even its emotional state by smelling its anal area. Think of it as a canine version of Guess That Scent, where they're trying to figure out if their friend had a run-in with a pizza box or a puddle before meeting up. 6. Social hierarchy. In a pack or group of dogs, smelling each other's behinds helps establish and reinforce the social hierarchy. Dominant dogs might initiate or allow this behavior more frequently. It's like their version of a red carpet event, where the VIPs get the first whiff of the latest scent trends. 5. Greeting Ritual For dogs, smelling each other's behinds is like a handshake or a greeting ritual. It's a polite and non-confrontational way of saying, hello, I mean no harm. It's as if they're saying, I come in peace, and I bring with me the delightful aroma of adventure. 4. Avoiding Conflict by smelling the rear end first, dogs can gauge whether the other dog is in a calm or aggressive state. This helps them avoid potential conflicts, consider it their version of a sniff test, before deciding whether to engage in a friendly chat or initiate a high-stakes game of chase. 3. Body Language Dogs communicate a lot through body language, and smelling each other's behinds is a form of reading and conveying signals about their intentions and emotions. It's like they're participating in a silent, slightly unconventional game of guess the mood that only they fully understand, no words necessary, just a nose for nuance. 2. Natural Behavior In the wild, dogs rely heavily on scent to navigate their environment, locate prey, and communicate with other pack members. This behavior has persisted in domesticated dogs, it's their way of keeping a sensational connection to their ancestral roots, even if they're now living the couch potato life with central heating and gourmet kibble. 1. Sensory Exploration Dogs experience the world primarily through their sense of smell. Sniffing each other's behinds allows them to explore their surroundings and the other dog's history in a unique and in-depth way. It's like they're reading an olfactory novel filled with twists, turns, and perhaps a hint of a mystery meat from yesterday's lunch adventure. While it might seem unusual to humans, smelling each other's behinds is a crucial and natural aspect of canine communication, helping dogs exchange a wealth of information in their own olfactory language. It's their version of a sharing the news, complete with a quick sniff to catch up on the latest neighborhood gossip, or should we say, sensational scoops. Consider subscribing to find out more about dogs.